I want to tell you a story about how Bill's phone kept some footage hostage for months. Hi, from the future. <laughs> Welcome home to Mailer's Landing. We have some nonsense to show you that was stuck in his phone for, my God, since June? Since since the end of June. Tell us about said footage, husband. So what you're about to see is what we're actually <laughs> sitting on, which is I made a deck for the front of the greenhouse out of reclaimed pallets. <laughs> And it's a freaking awesome deck. I'm just saying, I love this deck. I feel like such a princess when I sit out here in the morning with a hot cup of tea and I'm like surveying the garden from the comfort of my greenhouse. The Aww, orangery. The orangery. <laughs> uh, so yeah, we the, the whole deck is made out of pallets we picked up you know, just on the side of the road that we, you know, took apart and refinished and reclaimed. Um, the problem with the footage is not only was it a few months ago, I'm missing the whole first section of <laughs> the build. So... Tell us about the build, darling. Let me summarize. <laughs> so the foundation of the deck is made from two whole shipping pallets, not the standard wood slot ones. They're actually wood framed with a double layer of plywood on top. And we cut them up to, to size, dug out a little bit of the ground and then set it in so it would be level with the doorway of the greenhouse. So that was the, the first chunk of, of the video was me pulling out the pallets and measuring them out and cutting them to size and bolting them together and digging out the dirt and prepping it and getting everything ready and putting the foundation in. And it worked well. <laughs> Trust me. Um, it's solid. It's, it's solid. solid. We're, we're sitting on it and we're not falling through. So something worked. But that's that footage is somewhere in the cloud some where you don't because you didn't use the cloud right i did not use the cloud I don't that use the, the cloud footage either. is gone it's gone it went to the same place that that one stray sock does in your washing machine it's it's gone but i really like the eight minute or the the 45 minute piece that was supposed to be a time lapse but didn't yeah <laughs> set up a time lapse and then a time lapse um there were many uh, got halfway through building and we had a giant thunderstorm come through. Oh, that was good. That was good. Um, yeah. And we whole, got water in the basement. We got that water in the basement. The whole construction <laughs> took place during, during a massive heat wave. So when I'm out here talking about being sweaty and hot, it's almost a hundred degrees outside. And of course I'm doing this in the <laughs> sunniest place in the yard because that's greenhouse. where the greenhouse is. <laughs> so just take it as known that there is a foundation put in. But the most important thing to know about our adventures is that we are complete rookies at this. So we're going to make mistakes. You're going to see time traveling footage. All kinds of business is going to happen. We will catch elves on film. I am 100% certain in my heart of hearts. I am. Only if they help with the yard work. <laughs> Perhaps. So, so enjoy the starting the story in the middle adventure. <laughs> um, and I hope you like it and thanks. It's going to be great. Come on along. We'll show you. <laughs> okay. So back at the greenhouse deck project, I, um, had to take a few days off because it was pouring here and it's hard to work on the deck in the rain. Um, but today is mostly clear and things have dried out a bit, so I'm back at it. I finished the deck, uh, the deck base, the foundation for it, got it all installed. And now I'm getting ready to do some sealing and to start putting the boards on. I just ran in and picked up stain and we're gonna get, uh, started in getting everything ready and putting the top boards on and then we can sand and stain from there.
So let's get to it. I've got the base of the screenhouse deck done. I finished installing everything this morning. So it's in and level and secured. So the plan now is to put in some sealant along the seam at the greenhouse and start putting the deck boards on. Okay, so I got all the sealant in and I've laid out the pallet boards that we salvaged to make sure that I've got enough to cover the whole deck, and I do. Um, so in a minute, I'm gonna start doing the finish cutting and placing the, attaching the pallets to the deck. So I laid out all the reclaimed pallet boards to make sure we had enough to, to cover the deck, and we do but you'll also notice that some of them are broken off at the end or real, real jaggedy. And I knew that was gonna happen, not all of them detach perfectly. So what I'm gonna be doing is cutting those down so they have a square end and then taking a few of the other boards we have left and making fills and patches so it will have kind of a, a staggered look to it. And then we'll mix and match the boards going across so it's got almost a, an old hardwood floor appearance to it. Okay, so we've got all the pallet boards in and secured and ready to go. So now the only thing left is to take the circular saw and even off the front edge.
the deck is all trimmed and uh, squared up. And now my favorite part of the project, the sanding. You're gonna give it a good sanding, kind of smooth everything down because they're pallet boards, they're rough, there's some e unevenness, some cracks, some splintering. So we wanna make sure the surface is nice and clean and smooth before we put the stain and varnish on. So the deck is all sanded. So all that's left now is the trim on the edges and then we can uh, stain and seal. But the sun is going down. The sky is a beautiful color. And with that, I think it's time to call it a night. Okay, so new day. Rain has passed, sun is out, everything is dry, and it's time to finally put the, put the finished coating on the deck. We're going with a clear coat, which will help highlight the grain and the, the inconsistencies and the oddities because it's reclaimed wood. And so it should make it, give it a really nice appearance. And the first coat is done. As you can see, the clear coat really brought out the character and the grain of the wood. So we're gonna let that sit for a little while and dry. And then weather permitting, we will get a second coat on late this afternoon. I really like the way the pallet boards look now. It gives the deck a lot of character. It really makes it look at home here now. Second coat is on and drying, and the deck project is finally complete. Thanks for hanging out with us today. Catch you up soon. Bye-bye. Nice. It's true, though. Ta-da! I love this deck. I love it so much. All from reclaimed pallets we found on the side of the road. Best deck ever. I'm fist bumping you, but you did all the work. Yep. <laughs> <laughs>